Hello guys, welcome back to the Cuticle channel. My name is Ethan and I'm happy that you click this video. Today, tuturuan ko kayo kung paano gumawa ng logo gamit lang ang inyong smartphone. Yes, you heard it right. So kung ano man yung logo na gusto nyong gawin, gagawin natin yan. And I'm sure by the end of this video, you would be able to create your own logo for your YouTube channel, for your business, or kung ano man na paggagamitan sa logo mo. Alright, so let's go ahead and start. So ito yung logo namin guys. Um... Ito yung bagong logo namin ngayon. Yeah, so I just created this logo just this morning. I'm gonna walk you through how to create this logo by using two apps dito sa smartphones natin. The two apps that we will be using will be the PixArt. And the other one is the Pixilab which is our main, um, main editor app. The very first thing that you have to, to do is to conceptualize kung ano may yung logo na gusto nyo. Ano yung uh, graphics? May mga mga ready-made na mga mga graphics sa PixArt na gagamitin natin. So yun yung gagamitin natin for this tutorial. Let's go ahead and check the logo first. Ito yung logo natin. Ipapakita ko sa inyo yung screen o pamakita niyo yung kung ano yung gagawin. So ito yung logo natin. Napapansin niyo may mga characters na may dalawang bata, may bilog, may orange na bar tapos mga text. So, simple as that. So, these are actually ready-made items or stickers na ginamit lang natin upang makabuo tayo ng logo. Alright. So, una-unang gagawin natin is, is the download natin yung mga characters na gagamitin natin. So, let's go to our first app which is the PixArt. Then, in my case, since gusto ko yung bata, gahanap tayo ng stickers. And then, let's type boy. Then, hanapin natin yun. Nasa na ba yun siya? Ayan. So, ayan siya. Alright, so this is already a, um, a ready-made sticker. So, all you have to do is to save it. Click nyo yung check sign sa taas. Naka yung um, forward or yung arrow. Alright, so that sticker is already saved on your gallery ng phone mo. And then you just have to do the same with the other characters. Hindi ko na ipapakita sa inyo yun kasi the same, um, the same steps lang naman. Kung ano man yung laman ng, ng business nyo or yung YouTube nyo, yun din yung isearch nyo dun sa, sa, um, sa PixArt. Baka may matipuhan kayo mga, mga graphics o mga stickers na gusto nyo i-add dun sa logo nyo upang, mapa, upang mapaganda or upang, upang makagawa kayo ng logo na that would best represent your channel or your business or kung ano man. Since na-save na natin yung mga characters dun sa, sa gallery natin, let's go to our main editor app which is the Pixel app. So sa, sa Pixel app, yung default um, screen is green. Kung to check mo yung logo natin, yung background natin is white. Alright, so papalitan natin yan. Sa Pixel app, um, dito sa background, hanapin natin yung white. Pwede din kayong gumawa or mag-customize ng ibang background. Pwede kayong mag-download ng, ng mga graphics. So, let's say in this case, um, let's just let's just pretend na iibahin ko yung background. So, hanap tayo sa gallery. Hanap tayo ng mga background dito. Yan. Yung, yung pick na yan. Gagawin natin yung background. So, check lang natin yung, yung check. Then, adjust the size. Yan. So, we can use the one as our background. But, pangit naman um, tingnan kung ganyan. But, I'm just doing this for the sake of tutorial and example. So, we, we're just gonna go ahead and delete that um, that one anyway. So, to delete, you click on the layer. You click on the layer um, icon. This one. And then, you click on the delete um, icon. Ayan. So, we're back to the white background. Ilalagay natin yung kung anumang object na sa pinakailalim ng ating logo. So, kung titingnan nyo, sa logo namin, yung pinaka nasa ilalim ay yung bilog na may orange na bar. So, yun yung una-una natin ilalagay. Paano ba gawin yan? That's actually um, a pre-made object na makikita sa Pixelab. So, madaming object kang pagpipilian. All you have to do is to go to add yung my plus icon dito sa taas. And then, you go to sticker. Hanap tayo ng sticker dito sa baba, may cake, merong flower, may sunglasses, may mga sombrero, mga kamay. Um, saan 
na ba yun? Ito yun guys. Ito yung ginamit ko. So, na-add na natin. Wow, we just have to adjust the size. Drag natin yan. Ayan. Lagyan natin sa tamang position kung saan ano, nasa gitna. Alright. So, pag hindi, hindi siya magalaw guys, i-lock natin siya. Click niyo yung layer button. Tsaka may padlock dito. You click that padlock. Pag nag-orange na siya, meaning hindi na siya magalaw guys. So, to remove or to hide the layer button, or to hide the layer page, tap mo lang yung layer button again. Alright, nahay na. So, ayan, hindi na magalaw-galaw yung object natin. So, whatever we do with other objects later on, hindi na yan uh, matitista. So, the next thing that we're gonna do is to put highlight on our object. So, what I usually do is I put stroke on it. To put the stroke, you click on that. Click niyo yung hexagon na icon dito sa baba. Tapos, hanapin natin yung stroke. Yan, and then we enable it. And then, gagamitin natin yung black. Kasi black yung, black yung dito. Yung nasa gilid ng, ng below black yung kulay. So, black yung pipiliin natin. So, select black. Tsaka, scroll down lang. May makikita kang adjust dito. Um, gagawin natin makapal yung edges. So, huwag lang yung adjust. So, you can make it as thick as possible kung ano mang gusto mo o kung ano yung, yung, yung timpla mo. Nasa sayo na yun. But for us, um, ito yung ginamit ko. Um, medyo mas makapal yung black kung makita yung edges ng, ng bilog at saka yung, yung object. So, tapos na yan guys, i-click on the check button. Next is, ilalagay na natin yung sticker, yung, um, yung mga, mga boards. So, you click on the plus, plus sign again. And then, from the choices, you click on gallery kasi nasa gallery sila nakasave. Hanapin mo yung picture or yung object na galing sa PixArt, of course, kasi galing sila sa PixArt. Ayan, ayun na yung first na, first na bata. Adjust na natin yung size. Tapos lagay sa gitna. Then, do the same with what we did sa bilog natin. Lagyan natin siya ng stroke. But this time, since black yung black yung hair, black yung yung edges ng, ng picture. So, what we will do, or black yung edges ng, ng sticker, just to make a little, uh, a little difference, white yung gagamitin natin na stroke. So, enable the stroke. And then, adjust ng konti. Ayan. And then click on the check button. And then add natin yung pangalawang bata. So ginawa ko, pinag-holding hands ko silang dalawa. So we just have to adjust. Ayan. So para nag-holding hands na sila. Um. So napapansin niyo naka-layer sila, di ba? Um, mas mas parang nauna tong ano, mas nauna tong naka-headset na naka-headset na bata dun sa naka na bata. We can actually change the one. You go to layers, makikita niyo yung may eight dots dito sa every character or every object na nilagay niyo. You can long press the one, um, long press and then you move if you want the the other guy to be on top. So ayan. Ayan nasa unahan na siya but that's just for but that's just for for tutorial purposes for sa actual na logo na ginawa ko mas nakauna yung ano yung naka headset so we'll do that we'll reverse we'll undo all right so gawin din natin yung kuno yung ginawa natin sa unang bata we'll put the stroke and we'll make it white also and then click on the check so, it's good to go na guys, yung dalawang, um, dalawang kids. So, they represent me and Raul daw. <laughs> Wala lang. Yun yung lang. Ito lang yung nakita kong mga cute na, ano, na, mga, na mga stickers. So, ito yung pinili ko. So, we're good to go with that one. Um, we just have to lock the, the objects. Click on the pad on the padlock. Okay. So, next is ilalagay na natin yung text. Um, so, based dito sa ano... Maglalagay na tayo ng text. Double tap para makapag-type ka. And then nilagay ko that cuticle. Click 
okay? Alright, so since um, hindi na ito object, um, text na ito, so you click on the text, the text icon sa baba, yung letter A, nakikita nyo. That's for um, editing the text. So the first thing that we do is to adjust the size. Hanapin natin yung size, yan, and then we adjust it. And then we drag dito sa baba, tsaka change natin yung font. Kasi hindi yun yung tamang font na ginamit ko. So, dito sa, sa Pixel Lab, ang dami-daming choices ng font style. So, ito yung gusto kong uh, um, app kasi uh, pag gagawa ko ng logo or yung thumbnails ng, ng YouTube video namin, mas madali kong mahanap yung anong gustong font na ilalagay ko kasi madaming choices. So, we're just gonna go ahead and go to recent. So, ang ginamit kong font is itong Abril Patpa is regular for that. So, as you see, hindi siya nababasa. So, let's go ahead and change the color. Yung kulay na ginamit ko dito is parang yung kulay flesh. Ayan. And then, click on the check, the check button. And then, we'll go ahead and do the same with the rest of the other um, objects. Lalagyan natin ng stroke. Enable. And then, adjust. Ayan. siya pantay. So, let's move right here. Alright. So, yan na guys. So, let's check if same ba. So ayan guys, we're done creating our logo. So it's time for you to create yours naman. So napakadali lang. You just have to follow the steps kung ano man yung ginawa ko dun sa logo namin. Plus, kung gusto mong gawin ko ang logo ninyo, if you want me to create your logo, you can go ahead and comment below your YouTube channel at yung name na gusto mong lumabas sa, um, sa logo mo. And then, I'll create the logo for you. I will visit your channel upang ma-customize ko yung laman ng, ng channel mo sa logo na gagawin natin. All you have to do is to comment below and then subscribe to our channel and also like this button upang matulungan nyo naman yung channel namin. So magtulungan tayo, I will help you create your logo, you help us grow as well as a channel. So thank you so much, I hope you've learned something from this tutorial and if you want videos like this in the future, please go ahead and click the subscribe button and the bell notification so that you get updated with the next video na i-upload namin sa channel namin. Once again, this is Eton and you are watching the Kitty Cold Channel. See you on our next video. Goodbye!